5.15 a.m. Workout done. I'm all done. currently five in the morning you know and people are like this is my five to nine before my nine to five i don't normally do this okay but sometimes i go to sleep early like last night i like just passed out at 8 p.m and it's currently oh my baby's awake too we went to bed so early last night huh it's currently 5 15 a.m i actually woke up a little bit earlier but i was just like playing around on my phone i Blue just got a bath yesterday. That's why she has her little bandana. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> but I want to take advantage of waking up this early. And we're going to do my 5 a.m. morning routine. Because I used to do this all the time. And it's so productive. And I always feel so good when I do it. So, this is what I do. Ready? Okay, I have to transfer my footage. This memory card's about to be full. Ooh, big stretch. <laughs> I keep all my memory cards in this little pouch. I'm gonna transfer the footage. Oh, oops. Oh my god. <laughs> Let there be light. Hi. Normally I transfer my footage at night, but I just fell asleep, so I wasn't able to. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. One of my favorite things about waking up early is nobody's awake and nobody is going to bother me. Like this is just my time and no one, no one's gonna reach out to me. That's my favorite part. Okay, now I've got my stuff. Before I eat breakfast or do anything, I like to just like do a workout because I'm so tired right now that I don't even think about it. And if I just do the workout the first thing in the morning, then that's the best because I don't think about it. I'm gonna get a water. We're running low. Beep boop. Okay, and now I'm just gonna change. I can lick it, I can ride it while you slip in inside it. I can do all the little tricks and do the dick inside it. What do I want to wear? I want to wear the right color. Should we wear purple today? Let's do it. Bing bong. Fun fact, I did my research. Apparently, I used to wear thongs underneath like leggings and stuff like that, but then I did my research. Apparently, wearing thongs isn't good for you when you work out. So just know, every time you see me work out I'm most likely probably commando I don't like wearing underwear at the gym <laughs> it just feels so free <laughs> and then because I'm blind and I can't see I'm gonna put my contacts in this is my prescription I'm negative 175 hey, keep yawning I don't know if I should have a coffee before my workout but it's so crazy I'm like yawning but I don't feel tired like I was laying in bed and I couldn't fall asleep let's brush our teeth even though it's just me <laughs> we got to work 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 this out oh my god there's a hair and I just got a bunch of new Fenty Beauty in the morning I just like to put a little bit of moisturizer on I think this one I'm pretty sure has SPF too which is good even though I'm working mostly inside we have windows and it's just good to be wearing SPF especially in the car Khloe Kardashian was the one that told me I need to wear sunscreen in the car especially on my hands and my neck wait we match Fenty sponsor me <laughs> okay let's go oh someone's still sleepy <laughs> oh my god so i actually already ordered this but i'm pretty sure someone stole it from my front lawn i even have it on my security cameras and everything like what do you do when someone steals a package like can you take that to the police like i don't really know like i've only had someone steal my package before in la and like i lived in an apartment complex so it was fine but this is same day delivery so i'm gonna try and deliver it today okay to the gym. You want to come with me? Let's go. Ta -da. I like to put on a waist trainer. Oh, what? A waist trainer? What about it? What are you doing? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I think she thinks it's an outfit. <laughs> it's not an outfit, Blue. I like to put this on while I work out for the hourglass. I'll just put my clothes over top. Ta -da. This is my own machine, so I don't even use um, sneakers. I'm just gonna do, honestly, quick start.
my god, my headphones were at 1% the entire workout and somehow they lasted the entire workout. <laughs> I need to charge them, but workout done. I'm so much sweatier than I thought I'd be. I'm gonna take a shower. Okay, finally, you get attention, let's go. Okay. That was a good like 40 minute workout. I just did leg day, which is what I always do. And I just know how to do it. Um, but one thing that I wanna work on are my arms and my back. That's like my goal for this year. Now I'm gonna try and get a little bit ready. Okay. Yay, I curled my hair yesterday, two days ago, but these are hair, the, the hair. I curled my hair two days ago and it's still curly. Yay, I'll just maybe just like touch up a couple pieces. Oh my God, my legs are literally shaking. What the, it's cause I haven't worked on so long and that was a change to work out. Okay, I always wear hoodies every single day. I almost put on my merch, which you guys can shop. Link down below. It's Girl Supporting Girls Got Rights Collection. 100% of the proceeds are going to be donated. I was just gonna wear that, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna dress up cute today. I'm gonna do things today. I feel like when I dress up cute, I'm more motivated to get things done. Does that make sense? I don't know. Ta-da! You little bone on my bed. Bed made. Oh my God, it's almost seven. 6.43 and the sun is still not out. What? Anyways, I have a board on Pinterest of just like my favorite hairstyles. Madison Beer is in a lot of them. And I really like the hairstyle with the two braids at the front. So I think I might do that for my hair today and then just probably regular makeup. Oh my god, I don't know why I look so pale. Ah! I think it's the lighting, but I was watching Tara's vlogs. It's so cool. Like, I never realized until I moved back here to Toronto, because you guys know I lived in LA, like, during COVID and everything, and I feel like now I've been living more so in Toronto. There's so many, like, cool people here. Like, I didn't realize there's so many, like, at least when I first started YouTube, there wasn't anyone here. Like, everyone lived in LA. If you wanted to do collabs, if you wanted to meet anybody that's, like, in the same space, like, you had to be in LA. But now I feel like there's so many creators here in Toronto, and it's just so nice. And, like, honestly, ev like, People in LA, sometimes they're nice if they move there, but sometimes they're whack as f And like, if we're gonna be honest here, like I did it, like when you move to LA, you move to LA to collab with people and meet people and like meet people in the same genre and like basically like use each other. And <laughs> some people are whack as f when it comes to that but like everyone that i met in toronto has always been nice I, ca I can't even think of one creator that lives here that like i don't like but yeah oh my god my makeup is done what time is it 7 20 hair and makeup is done i think i was kind of munching on this protein bar this alani protein bar but i think i'm gonna make actual real breakfast also did you notice my microphone <laughs> my girl talk podcast is hopefully fingers crossed fingers crossed fingers crossed launching this month september um, i just like i'm signing with this one um like network where they basically make it so much easier for me like they're able to like upload it and edit it and like schedule it and they're just i don't know i'm excited about it we're like finally like making contracts and like making things happen i already have like a couple episodes all filmed so i'm so excited i've been wanting a podcast for so long we're going downstairs bing bong let's go Let's make breakfast. Blue, you wanna watch me make breakfast? Oh, hi. I'm gonna make some eggs. My dad and I organized it. These are his eggs. <laughs> and these are my eggs. Oh, he used it when he made breakfast for me the other day. I was like, it looks like someone's been using my eggs. So, boom, I fill this with water. Oh, okay. I think I'm gonna cook a couple for meal prepping purposes. Actually, no, I'm only gonna cook two. Plug her in. And then she should sing by the time she's all cooked. Look how cute my ice is. I just got these butterfly and heart ice cube makers. They're so cute. Look how cute they are. This is the best creamer. Everybody always asks me, they're like, Adam, where do you buy this in Canada? Because they always have this in the US, but they never have it in Canada. I got this. Don't tell anyone, because you better not sell it out. But it's from Walmart. And a lot of people said that they get it at Metro too. Like, I think you could get it at a lot of places. But don't you dare fucking sell it out, because I need to buy more. Mm, the most satisfying part of my day. <laughs> Look at how cute the little butterfly is. Like, it's really the little things that make me so happy. You want some breakfast? I decided to make a salmon bowl. 
because why not? I, I only made eggs for breakfast and I was like, mm, I'm kind of hungry. I don't want more than that. Ta-da! I think this is my favorite meal of life, actually. Mm. And it has the salmon, which is good for the protein. I'm gonna add my egg. This is just the best meal after a workout. Do you wanna see what I mean? It's yeah. so good. The TikTok bowl, remember? That's it's a TikTok so good. bowl? Yeah, so you get it with rice and then the salmon that I just made, and then mayo, soy sauce, hot sauce. And it's so good. Did you put honey? No. She doesn't put honey in a recipe. <laughs> oh! <laughs> You're just eating salmon? I didn't even season it. <laughs> I don't know what it is about waking up in the morning, but I think it's almost like a snowball effect. Like once you get one thing done, then you're like, oh my God, it's only this time. Like I should get this done, this done, this done. Like I just ate my breakfast and then I just journaled. Also, how cute is this fucking pen? <laughs> it's so cute, it's like a little Jigglypuff, but I started using this pen anyway. But I'm gonna take Blue out for a walk. A walk? We're gonna do a little walk. Um, but that's pretty much like the mo the end of my morning. It's almost nine and I'll pretty much be done by nine. But so proud of myself and I didn't even have Tim Hortons. I made my own breakfast today. You want your Tim Hortons? Here go. Um, I'm gonna give her a little walk. And then, but yeah, I'm like so proud of myself. Like today was such a productive morning. My assistant is coming at 10. So we're gonna have to get a couple things done for then. But yeah. Hi, we're back. <laughs> it's nine and I'm like pretty much like all done my morning. So if you were wondering, Adeline, what's your five to nine before your nine to five? That's what they say on TikTok. This is it. And keep in mind, I don't do this very often. Like I only do it when I have like the motivation and when I'm good. Um, so if you don't do this, like I'll watch like these five to nine videos and feel like shit about myself because I'll be like, oh my God, like I could literally never do that, blah, 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 blah. But trust me, you can. The thing that helps me the most with these type of morning routine videos is you have to go to sleep early and you have to force yourself to go to sleep early. Like I live literally force myself whatever you have to do I'm not condoning this but like I just took an edible at like 8 and I just passed out right at 8 whatever you have to do take a melatonin put a face mask on I know that face masks also really help you sleep but if you could go to bed at like 8 or 9 or 10 that really helps at least for me and my body I need like seven hours of sleep at least so going to bed early has really helped me if you want to start doing this early morning routine but I hope you guys enjoyed and today's merch shout of the day goes to Xanthia Edwards on Instagram. She's wearing her girl supporting girls green crew neck. She looks so cute. This looks like a vlog. Is this a vlog? It says uni vibes. Uni vibes and she has her beep up draw. Oh my god. I love that green color. That was such a good drop. And then today's tip of the day goes to Kennedy Pug on Instagram. You just tag me. That's how you become tip of the day. Her tip of the day says enjoy where you are now. I love this tip of the day because I feel like I'm always like oh like I'll probably like I'll, next week I'm just gonna start waking up early and next week I'm gonna do this and like like, oh, tomorrow I'm gonna do this and blah, blah, blah. The best moment or the best time, and this is so cheesy and I hate that I'm saying this and if I heard someone else say this to me, I'd be like, shut up, like you're so annoying. But the best time to start is right now. Like set your alarm at 8 p.m., 9 p.m. and go to bed super early tonight if you do wanna have that early morning routine. And I promise like it makes the biggest difference. And morning routines are the type of thing where like I can get pretty sad sometimes, especially with like fall coming up and like the winter depression. Like you guys know, getting a solid morning and night routine just helps your mental health so much having that time to do stuff for just you and like be selfish and journal and um, do your workouts and eat healthy like these are the things that I really want to get down packed in my schedule for like the fall time and the winter time because we all know how the winter is but I love you guys I'll see you guys in my next daily vlog tomorrow same place same time blue says love you love you say bye bye <laughs> Also, I just made blue TikTok. I just posted on it right now. Look at it, it's so cute. This is what I did. Mom, my belly is rumbling. <laughs> I hunger, mother. I, I hunger. hunger. Why do you start me? <laughs> it's my Frenchy name blue on TikTok. I also have my TikTok and girl supporting girls. I want to do a giveaway. So make sure that you're following those accounts and I'll be doing a giveaway soon. But I love you guys. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Bye.